today we'll be looking at a Benoli distribution we are going to generate the moment generating function the mean and the variance Bernoulli distribution is one of the discrete distribution in probability theory now the mass function is giving us probability of x equals to x equals to summation x run from 0 to 1 probability of x into bracket 1 minus p into probability of 1 minus x whereby our x runs from 0 and 1 Bernoulli distribution can only take two value and that is a 0 and 1 so the probability the moment generated function is given as mgt equals to um summation exponential raised to power t x multiplied by the probability of this distribution so if we try to open it up so we are going to have an m subscript x of t we stand for moment generated function summation x run from 0 to 1 exponential tx into or let me say multiply by probability of x then we have a 1 minus p here is the same thing as a q raised to the power 1 minus x p is the probability of success yq translate failure and p is given as 1 minus q and that is why i change this place to 1 minus q so now we cannot have this as a m x subscript x of t equals to summation x runs from 0 to 1 then there is raised to power x here there is raised to power x here then i can just join these two together it says exponential raised to power t let me say p exponential raised to power t everything into bracket x or we'll factorize x then we have q raised to power 1 minus x then this will lead us to the next level which is a m subscript x of t equals to now i want to substitute a zero and a one to it we have a probability exponential t when x is zero raised to power zero q raised to power one minus zero plus because here we have summation that is a uh, written there so we have a p exponential t raised to power when x is 1 because x can only take two value in Bernoulli distribution is 0 and 1 so we have 1 q raised to power 1 minus 1 and this will give us probably anything raised to power 0 will give us 1 so p exponential t raised to power 0 is 1 multiply by Q raised to the power 1, 1 minus 0, plus probability of exponential t equals raised to the power 1, then multiply by here we are going to have 0, 1 minus 1 will give us 0, so we can have it as a, and anything raised to the power 0, like we said here, will give us 1. So therefore, the moment generated function of Bernoulli distribution will be probability of exponential t plus q this is the moment generating function now from this moment generating function we want to derive our mean we want to derive mean of Bernoulli distribution we have a mean of Bernoulli 
Bernoulli distribution. The mean of Bernoulli distribution, say of x, will give us a p. That is the mean of Bernoulli distribution. And here we are trying to get the mean of a Bernoulli distribution. So therefore, we are going to differentiate this uh, moment generator function. The first difference, first order difference, and that will give us a um, let me write this, we have m subscript x of t equals to p exponential t plus q. Now, if I want to differentiate this, I'm going to have it this way. It says uh, p exponential t plus q. You can just have it like this. Say m prime subscript x of t. This time for first order difference equals to, and here we can just say this is a, a function of a function, or we can just we are differentiating with respect to t says uh, this um, this of our p exponential t. Then we are differentiating this. This definitely is going to give us zero. So we can have it as a p exponential t plus q 1 minus 1 multiplied by p exponential t if i differentiate this i'm going to have exactly what i have here and we should remember that here that i have um, 1 minus 1 you know definitely that's going to give us a uh, zero so if this give us zero we can just eliminate this i have m prime subscript x of t will be equals to p exponential t then we have to set t to be equals to zero we set t to be equals to zero then this definitely is going to give us a m prime x of zero equals to e of x we stand for mean and that is going to be of p exponential zero here yeah, we remember anything to power zero will be one so we have p multiplied by one and therefore e of x equals to p that is the mean of a uh, Bernoulli distribution then we need the variance the variance to get the variance is a variance of x equals to e of x square minus e of uh, e of x everything square so that will give us the variance of uh, Bernoulli distribution now we've already gotten e of x which is this we only need to square it but we need this e of x squared and for us to get this e of x squared that means you have to perform the second order derivative of uh, this is a moment generated function the first order from here you see this is the first order the first order gave us the mean now we want to try the second order derivative so I will just say m prime prime x of t equals to if I differentiate this further I'm still going to have p exponential t I'm not teaching differentiation here but you have to have the knowledge of uh, calculus in order to get this so we have p exponential t then set t to be equals to zero. Then I have m prime prime x of zero, which stands for e of x square, will be equals to p exponential zero. And definitely e of x square here too will give us p. So going back to this uh, variance formula, 
we have to substitute all this into it so therefore we can just have a variance of x equals to e of x squared minus e of x everything square e of x all square now we substitute all the variables there now we have a variable x equals to e of x squared give us p then therefore we just put p square minus um minus e of x and that give us a uh, all square so sorry i here we have a uh, e of x raised to power one because that's what we get to have e of x square is just p so we have e of x p raised to power one minus p raised to power two that is a uh, e of x everything is a power two here then from here you can just have it as a factorized p you have p into bracket one minus p and we shouldn't forget that uh, one minus p is equivalent to um one minus p is equivalent to q so this is our variance or better still we write it as a p q variance of a Bernoulli distribution will give us that the mean is a p while the variance is pq all of these we're getting from the moment generating function which is p exponential t plus q